Cool! Data to everyone from CashMorrow.com. Because this makes me more excited. On today's video, I'll be giving my overview of Wombat Dungeon Master Beta, currently in Season 3, and how the Womp Play Meta has changed. Or has it? Thank you, everybody, so much for joining me. I must say I do, do, do miss you all so much. I do apologize for the long wait in uploading again. It's been a very, very busy time in the Boner household. Uh, but I have been responding to comments that you guys put on um, the other videos. So hope that you all didn't think that I was gone forever. Uh, it's just been a really, really busy time. But family's good. My little boy is thriving. Just had a birthday celebration in Vegas about a month ago. Thanks to my amazing wife. Things are going on the up and up. So I'm glad to be back. And I should be now getting back to a consistent uploading schedule going forward. I uh, must ask you real quick if you like videos like this where I go over things like how to make crypto for free by playing video games, NFTs for free by playing mobile games, so on and so forth. Please make sure you give this video a like as it will get it in front of more people who could hopefully use this information so they could start it. So as I've still been using OnePlay over the last few months. Uh, OnePlay is one of the apps I have been keeping on or I should say have not taken away thus far. It still pays pretty well, uh, but the meta has changed a bit. Uh, I spoke a bit in my last one play video about how, unfortunately, due to more people joining the service, which is great in and of itself, but more people are earning one bucks, which are then in putting them into the pool, which will dilute more of most people's uh, output when they actually join the pool and get their EOS out of the uh, payout. And I went over the last video on the golden loot boxes and how I think that while they are a gamble, they might be the best way to do it. Technically, it's a calculated risk. And I still believe that to this day, I've been earning with fairly decent uh, frequency because the golden loot box, as seen down here, can't do it yet. Oh, let's open this. I open that every day. Uh, but the golden loot box will give you either uh, more one bucks. So one time I actually opened one for 50,000 and got 80,000 one bucks. And one time I actually got 50,000 one bucks. So it ends up just, you know, making me wait another day until I can gamble again. I've gotten uh, NFTs. I've gotten about five or six, mostly the Wombatium, Wombatium, whatever, NFTs. Uh, and EOS. I, one time I got like a couple of bucks in EOS. Uh, so it, it's a fairly decent gamble. Uh, but now, since ever since at the beginning of the year, Wamplay instituted the Wombat Dungeon Master where you can, it's a little game that you play where you can send your Wombat into the dungeon to find goodies or treasure. Uh, at the beginning it was just, I guess, points which you then traded in for EOS at the end of the season. But it's evolved over time. So let's get to that real quick. So if you don't have the link to it, what you can do is you can go to your NFTs. And this is the mobile version of the, of the Wombat app. Uh, you go here. Stake one play in a T Center in crypto, and you have the Wombat Dungeon Master. So, give a quick overview of this. Everybody can join it. Uh, I am not going to pretend to know enough about NFT and staking and the uh, and all this other stuff about it, about how they're developing this and the blockchain. Da 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 da. All I want to do is make more money, make more crypto, earn more crypto, so then I can make more money. And I want to show uh, that to you guys as well. So with Dungeon Master, the way it works is that you can uh, stake NFTs. And by that, I mean you hide them uh, in this game. And by the NFTs, I mean the ones you earn in one place. So like the ones you get from playing uh, Hero Zero, Tasty Tail, which are my recommendations if you want to start earning some NFTs pretty quickly. Uh, Arcane and a few other ones. So you hide them and that gives you... Uh, your wom your wombat digger here power in his dig and the more power he has uh, the more he gets up as far as uh, the amount of points which then translate into actual eos or wax at the end of the season and a higher chance of getting uh, packs which give you equipment uh, for your wombat now you might be saying well boner if i don't have any nfts what the hell's the point well if that's the case and i'd say you still do it because the packs you get which have equipment for your Wombat Digger are actually NFTs in them themselves. So you can then just use those and increase your power. So let's let me go through here real quick, go back to the game. 
You see right there, I had sent my Wombat out for one hour because I wanted you to see what the payout screen looks like. So I got 132 X XP and this much in, I'm going to call it green gems, uh, iron, and coal. I mean, well, I don't know. I, I, I'm sure it says it somewhere, but I'm not going to go through it. And every day, you get your rewards. I'm going to tap it here. And, I'm, and all I got this time was 2143 2739 points so those are the points that you'll accumulate and at the end of the season which lasts about a month you get a payout on uh, EOS or wax right now every hundred thousand points is a dollar so I have a ways to go but I've already made a couple of bucks from this in season one and season two and as you can see I have all of these NFTs hidden uh, from things I've earned so I have three packs hidden here and these, all of these, I earned from golden loot boxes. I got that from Dino uh, Dinosaur Park, also pretty quick. I also got this from golden loot boxes. I got one from Arcane, one from Tasty Tail, from, from Hero Zero, another one from Hero Zero. So now my Wombat has uh, a total of, where is it now? I'll show you in a second, the, the total mining power. So then what you do is you decide how uh, long to send your Wombat into the dungeon. And depending on the length of time is what the contribution is. And this contribution is based off of this multiplier, like above, beneath like one hour, five minutes, six hours, one day. Your NFT mining power and the level of your Wombat miner. The higher the level, the higher the, percent, the contribution as well. So obviously the highest you can do you would think, <laughs> would be a day, right? But that's only a 1x multiplier. But th this requires the least amount of upkeep from your part. So if you're just starting out, I recommend just doing it for a day. That way you don't really miss out. Because like for this example, it's 126. Six hours is 47.3. So in theory, even if you do this three times, that's more than this. But you have to remember to go into the app itself, open it up and claim your points and send your little Wombat out again. Or you won't, you know, get it. Same thing here, like... 13.1 so six times that is more than 47 but are you really going to be going back every hour or here 2.8 are you really going to be going back every five minutes so in this case because of the time of recording i'm going to set this for one hour and i'm going to get these that contribution in points and this in supplies and you use these materials here to buy things from the store don't have enough to buy any of these, but in essence, this allows you to upgrade your equipment and get other packs that have a higher rarity. And you see right here, I don't have any packs. And if I go to settings, oops, no. Let me see, equip my wombat. So this is what my wombat has equipped. I thought I had glasses. Hmm. I still am missing these equipments. You see NFT blend, I believe that way you can uh, blend packs, it's four recipes, sorry, and you can use these recipes to make other things. I don't have enough though, so I got to go back. Let's open that up again. But that's how Wombat Dungeon Master works. So in essence, it's another free way you can use to earn more EOS because this doesn't cost you anything. Like if you wanted to do it uh, from season one, all you could do is 24 hours. So this time thing was just added uh, last season, the materials were added this season, season three. And later on, they're going to let you have multiple Wombat Miners. So this thing's going to get hella complicated as time passes and as the, and the project uh, improves. So what I recommend, honestly, is like the earlier you start, because the level of your Wombat Miner, right now mine's at 11, will keep over time. So next season, I'll keep the same Wombat Miner. So if you start now, you'll be at a higher level as time progresses and more people join. And the good thing is that in this case, no matter how many people are in there, the value of the points is just close at the beginning of the season. So if you have a higher level Wombat uh, send in the dungeon, you'll earn more points, which then will lead to more EOS. And actually, you have to make a wax wallet as well to get all these things, but you can still get a payout in EOS. Just remember to change it if that's what you want to do. I forgot to do mine myself. Like I forgot to, if you go to settings on the bottom right there, Right there. Oh, play a sound. I can actually, you can actually do this too, though. Ah, I'm an idiot. I could have had that happen the entire time. 
and then I'd get a notification, but I, hmm, I highly doubt that if I have this close, I'll actually get that, but I'll let you guys know in the next video. But that's how Wombat Dungeon Master works. So in essence, the reason why I said the meta has changed is because you earned your Wombux, you got your golden loot box. I mean, this is my current recommendation for the way I think works. Earn your Wombux, get your golden loot box, hope you get an NFT from that loot box, and you earn, and the way, and the only games you should be playing to earn Wombux, by the way, are the ones that provide you NFTs, because otherwise, you're just, you're, you're just a single dipping, right? You want to, always want to double dip or more, if you can. So you can earn Wombux and get an NFT at the same time, that's why I recommend Hero Zero, Tasty Tail, uh, Arcane, up to uh, level 25, because I didn't know that the, that the, the game has seasons, so there is one, and this is just made me so mad. That reaching level 50 can get you 25,000 Wombucks for a chance of one NFT. I was level 48 when the damn season ended, so I'm so freaking upset. But there's other games like uh, Kingdoms, uh, King's Throne, uh, Vikings, War of Clans. The problem I had is that uh, some of these games I already installed through Misplay, so I couldn't get credit through here, so what was me? But again, like I said, my recommendation is that, or for the current meta. Well, first of all, don't forget that the referral program for uh, Wamplay is really nice. You get 20% of all of your referrals Wombucks earn. And I must say, I do appreciate all of you. I've already, over the course of the last year and a half or so, gotten quite a few referrals. So I do appreciate it. I'll have the referral link on the description of the video for those who want to support. But again, 20% uh, from your referrals Wombucks go to you. So it's freaking fantastic. But again, the meta right now for one play to earn as much money, I think, as possible, I better said the most crypto. Play NFT games, get Wombucks, and hopefully NFTs. You will use those NFTs in the Wombat Dungeon Master to get more points, which will then at the end of the season, which lasts about a month, you get more EOS back. Uh, and then you use your Wombucks to get golden loot boxes, which will help you get you more NFTs, which will use the Wombat Dungeon Master, which will increase your payout, so on and so forth. But that is it for this one, guys. Thank you, thank you so much for everything. I do really appreciate it. Appreciate it. I'm sorry, I forgot to mention. Thank you all so much for getting the channel up to about 3,000 subscribers. It really does mean a lot to me that even though uh, I was gone for quite a while, y'all were still watching, commenting, and being engaged. Uh, I do this because not only do I enjoy it, uh, but I really do want to get this information out there because it's free money you can get uh, for other things. Like this is one way of getting crypto or getting into the crypto game for free, not using any of your own cash. Uh, I Like I said, in my Microsoft Rewards videos, which I made a lot of, which I have some more coming soon. Uh, I've, I have gotten Xbox Game Pass Ultimate for free for years now. And, I, and my subscription is currently paid off until next uh, February or March. Uh, through no money of mine, just through Microsoft Rewards. And I got so many things like for gift cards from Amazon, like through Amazon receipt apps and so on and so forth. But thank you all so much. It's been a great ride and I'm not planning on uh, getting off of here anytime soon. Like I said, hopefully now I will get my upload schedule to a much uh, more consistent state. Uh, but again, so coming soon, I will do uh, another misplay video. It's been quite a few years I've had the app now, still using that one too. Microsoft Rewards. Uh, and I might make a case, believe it or not, for GameStop Pro membership. Ah! But again, thank you everyone so much for jo for joining. And again, if you like what you've been seeing, please make sure you give a little visit to the like, share, and subscribe buttons down below. If you have any questions, tips, comments, post them in the comments section. Right, go to play some games, make some money, spend some money, see some money, don't get boned. Get boning.